Hey, my name is Winslow. I'm starting a tech YouTube channel. I'm just going to be doing simple reviews of mobile phones and smartwatches and any cool tech I can find. It'd be really awesome if this video could get two likes. And thanks if you watch the whole Okay, so what I have today is a smartwatch. Just said smartwatch on the box. Didn't say anything else. Um, that I bought off a Thai electronics market. It's totally random. Not a lot of big brands there. I think there might have been some Samsungs. I saw a Note 1 there. It was pretty crazy, but um thought I'd just take it out, take it out, play with it a little bit, and see what I can get. And it was like, it was only $24. Um, so, you know, what can $24 get you in a smartwatch? So, um, it's got two buttons on the side. Um, a little USB part, port right here. It's really hard to open. Oh, man, that's gonna that that's a really big downside. It's got a USB type um, micro USB. Um, came a little plug right here, you know. Um, and so let's see if we can power it on. Oh. Wow. That, that was pretty loud. It actually it seems like it has a little good speaker. See on the back, maybe. Um, but powering it on. Oop. Okay, so it immediately tries to connect to your phone, which is kind of weird. Um, touch screen isn't that good. But it, it works. Um, let's see. Audio play. Okay, so you have to connect to do... Audio, um, there's a little QR, what is this, what is this? Oh, so it looks like there's a QR code that you can scan. I'll do that in a little bit, but Bluetooth, what is this? Okay, so it looks like you need to download an app to do most of this stuff, but it looks, it looks pretty good, I mean, it's got pretty laggy on the swiping but I mean it's it's decent for like $24 um, there's a little calculator um, there's sleep mode oh wow look so it's it's got a little timer on sleep mode you just, let's say start oh wow look I'm, I'm having a great sleep right now Wow, that's so so crazy. Um, like looks like a little phone finder. It'll make your phone buzz. Power saving mode back here. Can turn it off. Um, looks like a looks like Google Google Chrome, but it just says um browser. Don't even think it's Google Chrome. It's got Facebook, Twitter, but if you tap on them, it just says, please insert memory card. So I'll, I'll try to get a memory card a little bit later, see if we can actually like search on the web. But looks like you can call, message, phone book. There's probably your contacts. Looks pretty cool, but I, I haven't actually found the clock here. Wait. Um... Okay, so that's back. This top button right here, that's like going back. And then, so wait, what does this little bottom button do? Okay, so it turns on this, this screen light, if you can see. Okay, so this looks like the time has some little notifications up top, like battery, battery, it says Bluetooth, music, I don't even know what that is. Um, it turns off really fast um, but let's see if we can turn it off okay so the top button is a back to go back and it turns the watch off but um, here does it okay so it doesn't have it's not like always on so you can't touch it when it's off and it'll turn on but okay wow um, so totally different lock screen can't really oh what glitched out a little bit there I think okay so you can 
you can change the 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 time the watch face it looks like just by clicking on it then you open it by swiping man this is such a weird watch but so then we swipe get our camera oh look there's a camera on it yeah do you think do you even think that's a real camera let's see oh yeah kind of not not the best camera but wow it's it's a camera um little photo thing but still needs a memory card um but wow it's it's much better than i would expect for 24 dollars um wow yeah so i'll try to get a memory card and i'll pop it in and i'll tell you how this goes but